Hello everyone, Gold Coin here and welcome to another episode of Foundation in the Coastal Map. We are actually here on the 20th episode and I appreciate everyone who keeps supporting me during this journey. So let's go ahead and start the game. Make sure you check the description, the link for the 100 subscribers giveaway. We are 18 at the moment of recording this video. We are 18 subscribers away for 100 subscribers. Anyways, we are here where we left it. Looks like our bread production has, uh, you know, has been improved or improved a little bit. Uh, we were sitting at uh, 20 or less. Now we are 34, 60 before. Uh, we want to improve our cheese production as well. There's not much we can do about the fish production. Uh, we already talked about that in many episodes before. We're, uh, there's another wheat farming, wheat farm going on here, and we're gonna go ahead and do a dairy farm right here. Did we place the dairy farm before? I think we did not. I, I remember uh, was debating whether we should have it here or here. I'm actually gonna have it here. I like it here. Uh, maybe, maybe here in the back. Why not, right? So I think, what's the entrance? So something like that, outside territory. Oh, so, so we probably don't own that territory. Ooh, almost, very close. So ideally it would be here, but that's okay. We cannot build it there, we cannot build it there. I don't wanna, I don't wanna ruin our little row there. What if we place it? I mean, we can place it, I don't wanna place it like very too near of the mines. That doesn't make any sense for a, for a farm. Uh, place right so i'm just gonna place it right here right there i think that's gonna be a good place to for a wheat farm i mean not a wheat farm but a day farm and uh, all we need to do is probably have another cheese maker well we have two so we have plenty of cheese uh, makers so all we need is probably milk yep we do indeed uh we're producing enough beers fortunately unfortunately we are we cannot do anything with those right now a pay leave is uh, waiting for a mandate. We said that we're going to do labor. Let's make sure we are correct on that. Yes, we need labor to for the trade bonus to buy the trade bonus right there. And then there's promotion as well available. We're not going to worry about those. And what I'm going to do is do another sawmill. I think that'll come very handy in these uh, times right now. I think another sawmill produce more planks and sell those are gonna be good right so let's go ahead and place it something like here now let's see our people have not built any homes here yet only those two that they built in the last episode that was hilarious wasn't it uh okay so do we need more charcoal i said uh, oh okay so the bad weather here is here i completely forgot about that uh, I know we we were rushing everything because of the bad weather. So it, the, here it is. Let's see what happens. Uh, let's see. Do we want to put like a charcoal meal here? Uh, like a charcoal boner? Uh, let's see. I mean, that might not be a bad idea, to be honest, to put it there. But at the same time, as I said it before, I mean, we have 46 gold bars, 3 gold ore. And I think that's 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 you know okay for now it's not like it, we really are desperately needing that i mean gems uh they don't come very often but they don't come very quick so that's something we have to consider about let's see what else do we have to consider here uh, we have homes here what are people complaining it's probably food right food shortage uh, food shortage and <laughs> everything else <laughs> uh food shortage yeah every, everybody's complaining about food we're working on it, so bear with us right here. So, how are we doing on 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 marble? Okay, we have five marbles, and I think we need a fifty, right, for this insanity. <laughs> Thirty, actually. Oh, so they're delivering right now. Oh, cool. Did we leave someone there? I, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay, so we just need a uh, deliver four bundles. Wow. So it requires four bundle. We have eighteen uh, marble here and then he needs okay so he needs we need 30 here and 18 here maybe or 30 here so i don't know how it works but anyways let's see oh well here's the bad weather hopefully it goes fast let's go ahead and speed up time just just a little bit we don't want to rush it too much oh uh, here's the well we said that we were gonna build and uh 
I was I was actually thinking of expanding our wood keep, uh, uh, decorate even more. But right now we don't need more military. I think military it's okay right now. Uh, let's see, prepare troops. Uh, I thought we sent them. Looks like we did not. But let's go ahead and send most of them or the ones that are not wounded, so we can do an extra an extra mission or extra rewards. Let's see, what else they're doing here? So, okay, the witch farm is almost done. This one right here. And, in fact, it is done. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like how it got built there. Well, it's not bad. But the entrance is covered by the... <laughs> the entrance is covered by the... <laughs> by the mountain. All right, let's see. All right, so let's go ahead and paint the crop. Ooh. All right, so, yeah. Let's go ahead and do it all. Like, from here all the way down here. And then... I don't like that. Let's see how it go, how, how it works, if that works out. It's kind of big, I believe. Maybe not that big, but we can actually give it like more of a square, right? Something like that. All right. They just need to start, uh, you know, growing the wheat, and let's see how it goes. What is, what's that guy going? Okay, so that's the smelter. Cool. They're probably going. He's probably going, going all the way up here, getting the the charcoal, the coal. <laughs> then bring it in there. That's hilarious. All right. So he's working probably. Yep. People are working on the dairy farm and probably working on the sawmill. Good that to ha we have uh, enough uh, wood to produce more and more planks. We can actually put three people there, but we have to enable, of course, immigration for that. And it looks like our immigration is high. Let's see if we can survive at least 30 or 40 episodes on this series. I wish, uh, I mean, I, I, I'm hoping to see that at least 30. And it, I mean, looks like right now we can, everything looks phenomenal, right? But you never know. Dairy farm built. Okay, so hold on. Did I miss something? I did. I knew I was building a dairy farm. <laughs> I knew I was building a dairy farm somehow. You know, the, the, you know, the more... The more uh, or the more buildings you have, the bigger the city, the more stuff you you forget. Because uh, so let's go ahead and pause this one. We're probably gonna need that one eventually. But let's go ahead and pause this one and spawn some cows. Let's spawn a couple cows there. I don't know how, how many times I click, but I did click quite a few times. Just gonna keep call, keep clicking. All right. So we're, where are we storing the milk? Are we storing any milk here? We are not. So let's go ahead and store milk here and put a cheese maker right in the middle. I kind of want to do a cheese maker right in the middle here. Now, we can actually unpause. I'm going to unpause this one right here. And the cheese maker, I'm going to put it just for, for this one and then two dairy farms for these cheese makers. I think that's going to gonna make sense. I think it turned out very well to build that dairy farm over here and then over here. So we can have the cheese maker. Let's see, cheese maker. It doesn't affect desirability. So we can put it like right in the middle of the town if we want to. But uh, we can actually place it some, somewhere here. I mean, it's not. A, I don't think it's a bad idea even here. Might be a good idea just to have the cheese maker, uh, out, you know, outside or uh, like the building or the community. So I think right here will be a good place for the cheese maker, uh, as long as we have 150 coins. I'm just going to leave the placeholder there. And I, I saw that we already completed the sawmill. So we just need to wait for people to come in to assign them. Okay, so it looks like our wheat farm was successfully uh, completed, like all of it. So that's good. No access to food. huh? All right, we're working on the food. Bread's looking good. Berries, of course, are not looking good because it, they're in, decreased by 50%. And you can take a look here at effects. Uh, trade bonus. Okay, no, that's because of the clergy alliance. So, yields. Uh, so, twenty percent more for fish, fifty percent less for berries, wheat, and grapes, which we are not producing. And there's another trade bonus of sixteen percent from the clergy, kingdom, and labor alliance. So, a monk is requesting an artist. Let's see what they want. They want planks, and we we will deliver. We're definitely gonna deliver some planks, and I think we need influence for the people. So, let's go ahead and do that. And actually, now that we can deliver the planks, uh, why is it not delivering? Plank store for confirmed delivery. Uh, yes. Are they not in storage? They're probably not in the storage. Well, they 
Oh, they're here. Okay, so most of them are in the sawmill. All right, so we're probably going to need to hire more transporter, I believe. Uh, let's see. Let's see if they move it. Uh, uh, can we, uh, like, let's see. Du -du -du. I don't think an option is, like, make it empty. Ooh, look at that. Speaking of transporter, there you go. Let's assign a extra guy there. And uh, are we doing money? Let's build the cheese maker here. And I know what, what else. We're going to need up oh, the sawmill. That's true. Let's go ahead and assign three more people here. That's fine. Yeah. Everyone everyone is uh, employed. And that's really good. Hopefully, they're not complaining too much about uh, housing. Are they? Hopefully, they're not. Because, I mean, everybody's happy. Uh, not the miner. Because the miner is probably like all the way up this miner here. And they <laughs> like very secluded though. Right? We can assign another miner, but that's not necessary right now. I mean, he can move his house here if it becomes... Or they can buy, uh, you know, food from this market. And in fact, let's go ahead and increase the size of this market. Let's go ahead and assign another... Oh, I forgot to put the market center there. Yeah, I totally com completely forgot about it. We're going to put another, you know, market stall here just for the cheese right now. Let's see. How can we, how can we make it pretty? Maybe like that. I think that's gonna be that's gonna look good. And then we can play something like that, right? Just make it different. And uh, food stall, right? This is food. Uh, yeah, food stall sign. And uh, where's the other one? This one is here. We can place the other one right here, right? Food stall. Uh, I don't know. Right there. Maybe right there. Or oh, not that. This one. Oh, I actually like it. This right there. Yeah, I like it there. Or maybe here. Yep. Perfect. All right. We just need 50 coins. And uh, let's see. Can we... Yep. Uh, you see the success probability is extreme. So let's go ahead and keep them. Or tell them to keep them. For now. We deliver the planks. And then we can actually unlock the trade bonus. And then we have effects of 20% uh, here. And 60% here. And where's the other effect? Okay. 20%. So we have uh, 40... 56 percent of traded bonus does that mean they're buying stuff at a better price i don't know it doesn't look like it uh i don't quite remember how much but i i think it's that or maybe the trade when they they come and ask stuff like an envoy an envoy is requested an artist a monk is requested an artist that's what they mean by uh trade bonus we'll see now the plank situation i mean the tool situation is uh very slow we don't have that many uh, that much iron i wonder if we can place another one of these can we oh we can perfect so i think that's gonna be very very efficient there we don't have the money right now but uh soon as we have more we can actually build this one and then on the other side don't forget we have more iron on the other side all right everything's moving along um people is uh, you know they're always going to complain about food for now until we resolve the situation we start producing more milk, we start producing more uh, cheese, and everything else. So milk is being produced right now, fairly quick, right? Uh, how many How many cows? I wish it, it would tell me how many cows, but this is definitely more cows than the other one. At least that's what it looks like. I don't know if one guy will be sufficient for all that. So let's see. These guys should be cutting all of this uh, wood right here. I don't know why they're not doing it, but they should be definitely cutting everything here. And, uh, yeah, looks like they caught everything here. All right, so I guess they're working slowly, but secure. Very important. Let's see. So we got four people. I think we're going to wait for uh, this run right here. Not this one, but the iron mine to get finished. Or the iron ore. Can we put another stone deposit? I'm not going to put it. just want to make sure. Yep, I just wanted to make sure we, we can. Maybe we can do the same for the uh, 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 gold, right? Worst case scenario, yeah, we can. Worst case scenario, we have more gold here. We have quite a lot of gold. Um, we have two mines, and this one we probably can assign two or three. Two, one, two, just two. All right, perfect. All right, I'm not going to build it. We we don't... Uh, I mean, we could need it, but we don't have the people. We don't... And the problem about right now about I'm worried about is the money, right? So if we go to budget, we're exp spending... Uh, wow. Almost 9,800 uh, coins in upkeep. 
because of the building. So we have a 12,000 uh, coins uh, expense and we only made uh, income of 9,000. So we are losing money every month. That's very important to keep in mind. And, um, and that's the only reason why I believe right now is because of the trading situation. We are not making a lot of things that we can sell. We are not making bread uh, that we can sell. We don't have enough. We don't have enough uh, clothes that we can sell. We don't have enough plank that we can sell. Even polished stones. I mean, polished stones are not used that much. I I'm, I think I have it at 50, right? All right, so do we want to charge like crazy? Let's see. Have we lost anybody? We have not, but we are definitely wounded. There's one. Yeah, oh, two wounded. So, yep, no charge. Thank you. <laughs> Bring them back, please. Thank you. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're not making a lot of things like in bulk, right? So, I was going to take a look at the Polish stone, the trade resources. Polish stone, we're only selling at 50. I mean, we can decrease it to 30 right now. And, uh, you know, just to have a little bit of more income there. Uh, we're not selling anything else. Like, we're not selling... Uh, Berries, wine, of course, we're not selling. We're selling planks. Everything above what? We might we might want to decrease that to 50, right? Every, everything above 50, uh, 75. Let's decrease it to 50 just to have a little bit more cash or coins, that is. Jewelry, we're, we're keeping five just in case. Uh, I mean, do we want to sell them all? I mean, if we find five, it's only going to be, what? Two, six hundred, seven, seven fifty. Not that much. It's a lot, but it's not that much. We we are selling swords. That's very important, and we are selling. Uh, ooh, wants to buy. Hold on, wants to buy fish. Yeah, and these one candles. We cannot make any of those. I think for for to start making more money, we're probably gonna remember two or three episodes ago where we had like way too much money. I didn't we didn't know what 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 to do with it. Well, you know what happened, right? We promoted a bunch of people, but anyways, we'll we'll get to it again. So to unlock more stuff and start making more money, we just need some citizens and uh, ten of them. And to take care of citizens is gonna be a problem. And I think I'm gonna take care of the citizen once this is built, because citizens will like a very super high desirability. I mean, this high, it's that high desirability is here too, very high, and this will become very high. I believe once we we increase the church and we change the type of the church to the other one. And this one, of course, will become very high, I'm assuming. I'm, I'm assuming and I'm hoping too, right? <laughs> Oop, not that. Definitely not that. This, this. All right, so do we do we have to assign someone here? I'm just going to assign the guy here. Just just make start making bundle. And uh, people came in. All right, do we have anything that we needed? make money yep uh like for the money right there and uh what else do we have we have promotion available we're not even looking at those right now uh this is almost done here and work yep are we are we building this is it done it is not done it looks like uh let's see is it done yet i thought we built another one here uh where is it stone deposit we didn't build it I thought we placed it there. Oh, we didn't have the money, probably. Okay, so let's go ahead and build it right now. Oh, no, so they're building it. Just not looking... Uh, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Looks like they're they're building it. It's just... It's not... There's no... Oh, there it is. Okay. They're... Okay. They're waiting for tools. I'm waiting for... for yeah, for tools only. All right, yeah. Let's get here and, and uh, hope for that to improve our tool situation here. Because he's not producing iron... So he's not producing tools, so they're not producing swords, right? It's a production chain. One of them stops, the rest of them stops as well. We're not even storing iron here, right? All right, let's see. Milk. Ooh, zero milk. Wow, that was quick. They're, they're going fast on the milk. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and they're, I mean, they're selling a lot of stuff. And then we got to assign this person here, I forgot. Are we storing bread here? We are not. Where, where are we taking the bread we produce here, though? Is it being kept there, or... I mean, I can store bread here. I mean, I'd rather have it here for these people uh, other than having, having 
or walk all the way down here, story somewhere here. You know what I mean? Efficiency. Probably they're going to complain that these people are not having enough bread and then they have a lot, so they have to walk around. It's just going to be a mess. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. I mean, we can go crazy. We can pause the game and buy a territory if we want to, taking advantage of the money that we have that we probably won't have for long. In fact, it's already going down, so... <laughs> We just leave it there. It's okay. We're producing wheat. Uh, our bread situation is definitely, definitely improving a lot. We have four unemployed. Are we on, are we employed here? Yes, we are. Uh, we can uh, authorize this soon enough again. Do we want to put another one of those? We probably want to. Uh, I'm just going to... I mean, it looks like they're very, very slow right now. They're cutting very slow here. I wish they were done here. Here and here, especially here. I kind of want to rearrange this in a better way. But it'll come eventually. Nothing to worry about. So money looks better now. I mean, it's not going down that much, is it? Let's see. Well, <laughs> look at the upkeep. Yeah. And now with the dairy farm, the upkeep is probably even, even more. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and assign someone there and spawn one, two, three, four. Some cows there. Cool. Awesome. 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 Now, do we want to store cheese? Are we storing cheese here? We are not. And that's something we need to consider. Now, we can also store cheese and don't store wheat here because the wheat's probably being taken directly from here. Do they store any wheat? They do. So let them store the wheat here. And then and then the guy just they can just grab it from there. We'll see how it goes. If not, we just place another dairy farm. I mean, not dairy farm, but a granary, right? Let's see. So we're storing bread and we're storing cheese. And, uh, and are we making bread? We are indeed. <laughs> oh, that rhyme. <laughs> Wasn't my intention, but that's good. Nobody has built any more homes here. We have plenty of planks. So uh, let's see. Uh, planks, planks. Yeah, we can still sell above 50. They're making way too much planks. I'm worried that they're gonna start making, uh, you know, <laughs> our wood start gonna, gonna start to decrease, especially if we have to add another charcoal burner. Right now we're good in charcoal. Uh, they just need one and one to make tool. And what about him? He needs one. That's fine. And then they probably need one to the old smelters and whatnot. I'm ready to get out of this bad weather. I'm telling you, the bad weather is very loud. And it, it affects us. I want to see... Ooh, look at that. How the bread went to down to zero. I want to see how food is, is being processed everywhere. Be uh, once we are out of the bad weather. Now, cheesemaker is built. Let's go ahead and assign a cheesemaker. Let's assign two of them right now. Everybody employ. No, three of them. Do we want to put another sheep farm? I think it's going to be a good idea to put another sheep farm. Like right next to our wheat, uh, uh, what is it called? A cow dairy farm. Because that way we can start producing more uh, cloth, wool for the cloth. Yeah, we have to increase our production chains. That's that's what I mean. I, I meant by that. We have to start producing more more of each stuff, right? We have to. If we have one. We have now. We need two. If we had two of the wheat farm. Now we have five. You know what I mean? Because we have almost 160. A citizen or, or you know people in our village but that's very important to consider to to keep in mind all right let's go ahead and pay, place our ship farm there a invoice request and an audience let's see what they want all right they want 20 fish unfortunately i'm not gonna provide it uh i'm gonna keep it all assign another one here and assign cheese here i run the post complete and we have exactly two miners and that's enough for the other mine all right so we are building a ship farm here we're probably gonna need to consider the building another weaver hut and another tailor workshop i think with one tailor workshop might be sufficient maybe with two of them actually right now because we're producing uh more cloth you see we don't have any cloth or wool so they are gathering everything pretty quick Oh, they're going through everything pretty quick. Now let me see. Is is he going through everything pretty quick too? So I think with the only with only the ship farm we might be okay. 
We'll see. We'll see how it goes. There's another bailiff for Mandy. I mean, there's another Mandy for the bailiff, so we'll do that one. Just keep increasing this influence because we're going to need it for the tax office and for the Commonwealth Workshop additional parts. Okay. Now, did we unlock the Commonwealth Workshop uh, or the regular Commonwealth? Oh, so, oh, I see. I see why. I was like, why are we... Okay, so that makes sense. So if we accept this one, trade bonus with Village of Clergy Alliance, every time we help the clergy, it's going to give us a trade bonus. If Every time we help the people, we get extra trade bonus. Okay, that makes sense. I didn't know. I didn't understand what they were for, but now we understood. That's a good thing, and, every, and I say it every single episode. You're probably growing tired of, of hearing that, but... That's important of playing games and not getting stressed uh, on your first, second, third, even fifth or nth playthrough because you learn something new every time you play it and then you come back with a better strategy and a better mind to succeed. For example, right now, in this case, we learned that, you know, it's not as of right now, update 1.8, it is not efficient or it is not possible to have a city secluded like that right now or at the beginning of the game because people like to live close to their workplace um uh, i don't know i mean i don't know if that's going to change completely in the next uh, update which is 1.9 but it's definitely they said that they're going to rebuild or remodel the residency or residency whatever it's called <laughs> the residential situation residency or something. what did i say i even i for completely forgot what i said <laughs> But anyways, all right. Yeah, I think <laughs> I think I spawned way too many cows. Uh, <laughs> how's he doing though? Is, are we doing good in milk, or is it like we don't even have enough milk? So <laughs> we probably have to spam more. All right, how are we doing in the wood here? So they removed the whole thing here. Now, what do we want to do? That's the question: Is what do we want to do with this space? Right, uh, that's very important. Do we want to? Let's place that there and then closer here. Perfect, right? I don't see it, but I think it's nab, so I'm not gonna even touch it. So what do we wanna do? Do we wanna keep this as a village? All of this? I think that that'll be a great idea. We can even put a little lower manor here. In fact, we can place it right here. That'll be a really nice uh, option to place a lower manor. That'll increase the durability a little bit more. And then, oh no. Never mind, right there, like that. Oh my god, I keep oh I keep pressing the wrong uh, click on the mouse. We can place a lower manor there that can help us with the treasury. And then all of these farm, we can have another wheat farm, another uh, dairy farm, or sh sheep farm. We have actually three dairy farms, which I'm very impressed of. We should start, you know, we should be having more cheese eventually. Yep, we are, which is good. Which is very, very, very good. Uh, the people just came in time for ship. Okay, don't abuse. She will just stop. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. Now do, let's go ahead and disable immigration for now. We don't wanna go too crazy. How are we looking here? Resources missing. Of course, we're missing the bundles, and that's part of him. Oh, he have the thirty marvels, marvels already. Oh wow, that's quite a lot. Uh, is he historian so hard? I don't think we're storing the marble anywhere. But anyways, I'm going to assign someone there, which is good. And I'm going to assign someone here for I'm going to I'm going to start producing more here. I think the the more the more stones we produce the better. Not stones, but iron the better because that way uh, we can produce more tools, we can produce more swords and we can make more money that way. So the upkeep is going to go up. I understand that. But I think iron is uh, very, very important, especially for tools. Uh, gold right now, eh, it's arguable. We don't need gold. And quartz, we don't need it right away. But we're definitely going to need it. Kind of build, why not? Resource depot? Oh, yeah, okay. Makes sense. The crane. I know, I know. It's my ball. My bad. Right there. And, uh, you know, the typical abandoned car there in the back. All right, let's see. We have anything else? Uh, we don't have to touch these, right? 
they're just building whatever they can there and uh, here hopefully we can start seeing this clear because i really want to expand this like right here like all the way up here and then maybe putting another little wheat farm here or we can expand here we'll see we'll see how we can do it i just don't want them to go this way you know what i mean and then close this completely that'll be best so cheese is going up a little bit bread's going up a little bit we're surviving happiness is okay what are people complaining about uh they're not very happy here and it's because of probably food at least they're not like in red where that's scary when you see like minus 70 percent or something food shortage that's fine we'll <laughs> i keep saying that's fine and we'll work on it military mission available let's see if we have enough military yeah we are we we do have fully trained let's see part oh fully trained look at that Perfect. So fully trained, partially trained, partially trained, partially trained, partially trained. All right. So we're sending five, which can help us with the rest of this stuff. So how many we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We haven't lost anyone yet, which is good. Since we assigned nine of them. Let's see. Is there anything else that we're missing here for now? I don't think so. I mean, everything is going good. Everything is going perfect. Uh, we're surviving and that's the part of the game yeah we're going down in cloth that that's you know this is supposed to help us with that they're going to be storing the wool, wool here and they're going to be making uh cloth we might want to assign an extra person here or let's see who where do we want to assign an extra person because that that's going to be we can actually remove someone from here he doesn't need to carry much stuff we can assign one here just in case they have to go to the bread, uh, the all the wheat farms, that is. Uh, over here, we can, uh, I mean, we can assign another one here. It's not necessarily, it's not 100% necessary. Here we have fish, hop, milk. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and assign one more here, just in case. We have two extras. Uh, we can assign one here and here. Let's see, we can assign iron here. No, that's okay. Yeah, I think we're good for now. Yeah, let's keep it this way. Let's keep one. We can unassign one if we need to to assign it to the next iron ore. But for now, I think that's going to be all, guys. Uh, the, thank you for being here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. I will see you in the next episode. I will see you next time. And I will see you very, very soon. Bye-bye.